We're playing Banjo Kazooie! Like my favorite game ever, sorry. <laughs> yeah. Do I need a controller for this? No, this is only one player too. Yeah. The the next three are all multiplayer though, so that's fun. Oh yeah, I know. We Mario have to listen to this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I actually surprisingly remember the story to this. Well, it's not that, uh... It's not that huge of a story. Yeah, no. He has to save his little sister from, uh, from Tilda. So I'm not gonna start a new level with this. Like, a new game save. I think we're just gonna play through the game. Like um, you said, it's long. Yeah, cause it is a long tutorial. Huh. I wonder if I saw my save file from when I was a kid. I hate games where you can't skip the tutorial. Those yeah, the um, I mean, technically you can skip the tutorial. Well, I think you can skip the tutorial on this, but yeah, I think it's like hard because there's still like more uh, like items and stuff you have to catch. Okay, yeah, we, we got the... We got the gist of it. Yeah. Huh, two, three, four. game where you actually have to hit start to play start. You can't just hit A. Alright, so I got 50 Jiggies. 50 Jiggies. 11 Jiggies. And 23. Alright, let's go to 50, because I have tons of them. How many are there? Uh, I don't remember. I've never beat this game, actually. What? Yeah, I've never beaten Banjo-Kazooie. Oh, I remember that! I remember doing that. Yeah. I used to do that all the time. Yeah, this is the best way to get, a, get around because it's so quick. I feel bad for the chicken. Or the rooster, whatever it is. It's just a bird. Kadu is just a bird. Um, let's see what level Oh, I get why to. they named it what it is. Because it's a banjo and a kazoo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I, caught just, on. <laughs> I just noticed that. Good job. I was at the um, nature's classroom and the name of the road was Canyon Road and one of the dining halls was Canyon Hall. Yeah. And one of the counselors who worked there and slept there didn't notice it until I, t I told them. Yeah. You already have a video, you don't need those. Well, it's, I, I wasn't going through just to get those. I was going through to see where this is going. Oh. Gosh, Bren. It's been so long since I played this. How the hell do I get up there? About to jump? Come on. I can do it. Those noises, though. Oh, yeah. The freaking sound effects and stuff in this game were awesome. Dang it. Have you heard of, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, Ukulele? Yeah. That game that's coming out? Oh, it's basically a, um, <clears throat> oh, so you haven't heard of the, the game. You've heard of the instrument, I'm assuming. Yeah, I've heard of the okay. instrument. I've played it. Uh, so there's a game calling out, coming out called Ukulele. So when this, this game was made by the company Rare, Rareware, and they were sold to Microsoft, and they made a really bad game for the Xbox 360 called Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts. Um, it, it had its problems. It was okay, but it wasn't really a Banjo-Kazooie game. And a lot of fans complained and stuff like that. And unfortunately, Banjo-Kazooie is still owned by Microsoft. Um, so, and they're just, they're um, like a, there's a game software, or a game character that no one's going to use properly or whatever, so people have kind of given up on Banjo-Kazooie. But the guys who originally made Banjo-Kazooie, the guys who worked for Rare, don't work for them, like, anymore. And they made their own company called Platonic Games, and they're basically making a new Banjo-Kazooie without you actually using Banjo-Kazooie. Because that would get copyrighted or whatever. Yeah, yeah, it's... 
the intellectual property now, technically, of, uh, Ra of uh, Rare, Microsoft or whatever. So they're making a new game called uh, Ukulele that's about a bat and a lizard. And uh, it looks a lot of fun. I backed it on Kickstarter. And uh, we'll have to play it when it comes out. Right. I got it on PlayStation. Oh, it's on the P PS4. Uh, it's coming out on all consoles. I don't remember if I actually beat these levels or not. On the Wii? Yep, Wii U is coming out as well. I think. It might not be. The, no one gives credit to Nintendo anymore. Yeah. Well, when you make a system like the Wii U. Well, I, I thought I heard stuff about the Nintendo FX. Right? Oh, NX? Or NX, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna come out eventually, but I don't think they're gonna it, the, be talking about it the at the box a... actually looks cool, though. Well, they haven't shown it. Oh, no, I've seen pictures of it. There's, it's probably not real. Like, when they say, like, oh, I sh I've seen the NX or whatever, like, those are all fake. <laughs> Unless you see Nintendo, like, actually, like, showing it on their page, it's not real. Unfortunately. People are saying how Bigfoot is not real. Yeah. And all that. <laughs> Where are you going with this, Brian? <laughs> well, but then, the other day at school, my friends were saying how they were find they found living organisms from the moon on the window of the... On like the glass window of the um the spaceship. Yeah. And so they they posted it on NASA's page. Okay. And they said it wasn't real. But this is what I'm saying. Unless it's on their page, it's not real. Yeah. So what does that have to do with Bigfoot? <laughs> no, I, I was just watching that. <laughs> okay. I like Big, Bigfoot. Okay then. So, Brian, I hate to burst your bubble, but Bigfoot, Bigfoot's probably, probably not real. <laughs> can I go in here? Yeah, I can. Yeah. I don't remember if I've done this or not. I probably have. I don't remember what I've done on this save file or not. Yeah, I was from... <laughs> oh, gosh, who knows? knows I don't know. Yeah, I don't think there's anything to do in here. This game is a lot of fun. I I appreciate it a lot. I love the characters and I love um, the gameplay. is super fun. Do you want to play? I don't even know how. All right. Well, I'll get you out of water. All right. I'm gonna leave this level. Um. Oh shoot. I have to actually go back to the launch pad. Uh. Okay, we can do this. Okay, that's how you do it. Okay, you have to hold B while swimming to go a little bit faster. Oh no! I hate getting free swim slow. Well, you go fast when you're holding B. No, I'm saying I hate games where you're just naturally swimming slow and you can't go fast like Mario yeah. Bros or something. Because it, like, it's not like you could run underwater. Yeah. It's so funny you referring to Mario Bros, but I think the only Mario Bros you've actually played were the new ones, right? Mm. Have you ever played any of the classic like 8-bit ones? Yes, I have. On an actual console? Not the actual console made for it, but I played it. I, I don't... It's... I, I have... I'm getting the... Atari. No! <laughs> I'm gonna die. But, but I'm getting the Atari, which means I can play it. It's not a... It's not... A, Mario's not on Atari. Oh. <laughs> what do you think was... I don't know. You think Mario's on Atari? I don't know. Oh, Brennan. You have so much to learn. I know. Oh, jeez. Atari is like yeah, I just Pong noticed. and I like. Just, I just remembered. Uh huh. Sure. Nintendo is the only console that has Mario. Atari is not Nintendo. So what was the first? The first ever console was Atari. 
No, for Nintendo. The Nintendo Entertainment System. Oh, the NES. Yeah. And you have the SNES. Yep, I have a new. I have a. I have a regular Nintendo too. It's at my mom's house. I think. I only have one game. For I, it, I actually. I have a feeling. Yes, I have played. My friend Tyler has one. Yeah. He, he one. Shout out to Brennan's friend Tyler. <laughs> if you're watching. He's probably not. Why won't you tell him about this? Is it too embarrassing? No, I'll tell him about it. He just probably won't watch it as soon as it publishes. Uh, doesn't mean there's not shout out time. You're lucky I could like super embarrass you on the show, but I won't because I'm nice. I mean, you're my brother. Yeah. Doesn't mean I won't super embarrass you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just remembered who you were. I'm trying to get you to an actual level that, like, I haven't beaten. Those noises. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. Just non-stop noises. Pretty much. The only way to get around fast. Yeah. But, uh, I don't think I've ever found the, uh... To be honest, I actually do remember these noises, though. Yeah. When, like, we used to play it. Is it nostalgic, Bren? Um, it was only four or five years ago. <laughs> I know, but that's like half your life. <laughs> sort of, yeah. Not sort of, it is. <laughs> I'm almost a little bit Exactly. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, well there's... The, okay. So, we need to actually find, like, a level to play. <laughs> the whole point of the game is finding the level. Pretty much. There's a game that, that someone plays, I don't remember what game it was, but it takes, like, a half an hour just to get to the level. Yeah. I should probably actually walk on this, because it's really, uh... Because mm. that happens. Oof. Oh boy. Should have started from the beginning so we can actually play a game. I don't even know where this goes. You think I should? Yeah. Good call. <laughs> oh my god. You're <laughs> right there, too. Ugh. <sighs> Oh yeah, I do. Doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm not in an actual level right now. To be fair, I haven't played this in a long time. I played Banjo Tooie a lot since I, uh, since I became an adult. Well, I don't think I've really played. Oh, you can, seriously, can't even get in through there. I need to be a different character. Dang it. What do you want to be? Basically, uh, I don't know. There's this guy, Mumbo, who changes you into different characters. Like, different animals. Yeah. Okay. I'm going... We're... we're I'm going to go to make a new save file, and then we can actually play I some did. actual levels. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna cut out the very beginning of the tutorial and stuff. Right. So we'll be back with actual banjo kazooie fun. Classic. <laughs> 